going on guys and welcome back to my channel. For those of you that are new, make sure to smash that like button and just love tap that subscribe button for more content. Today I wanted to go over the Zai Yoon, I think it's pronounced, sorry if I'm saying it wrong, Zai Yoon um, Crane V2. So it's a gimbal uh, for the DSLR, uh, this is my first one ever so I'm new to this, setting it up and everything, we'll go ahead and walk through it in case you guys are interested in getting this. Uh, you'll get an idea of what comes inside the box and how to set it up. Alright, so as you can tell, there's something missing right here. So my girlfriend decided to sell our dining room table, but we haven't picked a new one out. So I'm going to have to do this on the couch. And as you can tell, I already got excited. I opened up the box, but as you can see, there's nothing in there. All that was in there was this little fun crate that we're going to open up right now and see what's inside. All right, so what comes inside? All right, so it's nice and cushiony. Uh, this is everything that comes inside. So, don't know what these are. Of course, those are always fun. Um, okay, so we have instructions, I see. All right, so there, there's the uh, user guide. And you know, we're men, we don't need this. So, let's just start putting this thing together, I guess. What comes in here? All right, so we got batteries included um what is this a little charger for the batteries we have ooh, what's in here all right now i'm gonna start getting confused i don't know what these little things are we'll figure it out as we go oh this looks like it's some sort of screw looks like it's some sort of screw we'll figure out where that goes another one Ah, uh, that's the big guy. All right, so what is this? Little charging cable, probably. Um, I guess to attach the DSLR to. And then we got, ooh, oh, this guy. How does this thing work? It feels so smooth. It's crazy. All right. Let's read the instructions so I know how to set this up. All right, first things first, we gotta charge these. Once that goes from red to blue, it's fully charged. So we're gonna let those charge while you start setting up the rest of the crane. All right, since I have the camera on there, I'm gonna have to use my cell phone to record this portion. Uh, so the first thing is pretty much putting your camera on this little mounting plate right here. So the plate's right there, and as you can see, oh my God, it's so scary. Um, the camera, where is it? There's a screw down there, right there, that silver piece. It screws to the bottom of your camera, and that's what's um, holding the camera onto the mounting bracket. So, what's a better way to show you? All right, so I'm holding it like this. So yeah, so that little screw right there goes through the plate and into your camera, and that's what is holding your camera right now. Uh, it looks like this one. I guess this was like an extra one but this is pretty much, goes right under your camera, screws right into the plate. All right, so first it wants you to loosen the thumb screw at the bottom of the quick mounting plate to allow forward and backward sliding of the plate. So that's, what is it? That's um, this thumb screw right there. So you're gonna wanna loosen that one right there. And this plate that the camera is on is going to allow you to slide the camera forward or backwards so that you can get it level so that you can get the camera level like right now it's tilted a little forward um, so what I could do is I could loosen that slide that slide that plate back sorry for this <laughs> it's hard to record with one hand and hold this with the other but that plate right there where the camera is sitting on you can slide that back so that the camera tilts back a little bit and it'll be even. So I'm gonna go ahead and adjust that right now. So as you can see, I tilted it back a little bit and now the camera's facing a little higher. So you gotta tweak it and find the perfect, the perfect happy medium so that the camera's balanced. Once you have that set up, it's gonna want you to loosen this screw right here, that gray one, so that you can face your camera directly up. So it's facing up right now. So it's this bracket right here. So when you loosen that uh, gray screw, 
This bracket right here, you can move uh, left and right and it'll adjust your camera so that it can balance and face straight up. All right, once that one's situated, you can grab, uh, start loosening this back screw right here, this gray one, and that's gonna allow you to shift it from left to right so that your left to right is balanced. So as you can see, the camera's not tilting to the left or to the right, and that's because I was moving this bracket around, finding that happy medium so that it's balanced. All right, now the last part, this screw right here, you're gonna loosen that so you can move this bracket left to right so that your camera, as I'm holding it from here, you can see that the camera is facing to the left there and this um, little motor is behind it there. It's not above it, it's not under it. You gotta find the happy medium so that the motor is back there. As you can see here in the picture, see how the motor is back there? It's not above it over here and not under it. That's when you loosen this and you play around with it, you're gonna notice this motor is gonna slide under, it's gonna slide over, but you need it over here. All right guys, so it's been a few months later and I finally got some footage with the Zion crane. So I will be placing that right here. What a wonderful So after using the crane a few times, I find it to work amazing. Everything has been stable, it's smooth, it even has a little joystick on there that you can use to turn the camera left, right, up, down, um, and everything looks amazing. Uh, the one downfall, I would say it does get a little heavy, so I recommend getting the handlebars that you can attach to it, uh, which I plan on getting soon. It'll just make it easier to like maneuver around. Um, but other than that, I love it. I love using it. So if you guys enjoyed this video or found it helpful, please don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you on the next one. Thanks. Who's that? Who's that right there? It just completely turned. So after using it a few times.